forward to in the world of sports. There's a lot to look forward in the world of sports. And yes, we're talking about a lot to look forward to. And Bula Ahmed Eno is standing by. On the other side, that is the Mudaiga Golf Club. And he is going to be telling us, Abula, actually, what is happening at Mudaiga? Because we know the Kenyans, the two Kenyans who made that cut, who are representing the country, are not doing the best, actually. Maybe the results are somehow dismal. But is there any hope that maybe tides will go the Kenyan way and we might win it? Moses, uh, indeed, a lot is expected here at Mudaiga Sports Club in Nairobi, where today, remember, it is the third or the fourth and final day of the 2018 Kenya Open Golf Tournament. And uh, as we spoke yesterday and uh, earlier today, remember, uh, Sebastian Soldeberg from Sweden is still uh, at the top of the leaderboard with uh, 12 uh, under. Uh, that is uh, registering good results from day one. Remember, he had an, uh, one under in day one and uh, five under in day, uh, six under in day two and in day three registered uh, six under. So the last round has just begun. So we are talking about in the next hour or so, we are going to know the winner of the 2018 Kenya Open Golf Tournament. Uh, remember, it is uh, one of the first event of the European Challenge Tour. A lot is expected from now till uh, around uh, 6 p.m. in the evening. And uh, a lot is at stake. Remember, 10 million Kenya shillings, as you said, uh, to the winner. And uh, the second person will receive around uh, 6 million Kenya shillings. There is a prize uh, from uh, number one to number 60. And uh, it has been compared to some of the top golf tournaments in the world. Uh, talking about the top uh, golf tournaments, uh, speaking about Masters. Remember, the winner uh, who will uh, receive the 10 million Kenya shillings, apart from the money, is also going uh, to go away with a specific jacket call it the green jacket we know about the masters and uh, one of the things that people talk about when you talk about the masters is the green jacket and I'm, I'm joined by one of the uh, people who are very instrumental in this tournament especially the 50th edition of the uh, kenya open golf tournament i'm joined by nick who is uh, one of the uh, let's say a uh, fashion guy and uh, is here for a specific reason uh, welcome to ktn scholar nick and uh, tell us why are you here uh, I'm here because uh, I was, since it was the 50th year of uh, the back, the Kenya Open, uh, they wanted to commemor commemorate it in like uh, a really special way, and uh, they told chose six designers to come up with a, you know a design for a jacket that would re represent Kenya as a as a destination, and uh, since every big tournament, golf tournament out there gives out a jacket from the Augusta to the British Open to any big tournament out there. So commemorating 50 years, uh, Kenya Open wanted to give out a jacket too, plus the prize money and, uh, and the trophy. And uh, I won the challenge, and uh, I'm glad my jacket is going to be worn, and uh, hopefully every year from now henceforth. That will we'll talk more about the jacket and how you, you, you won. Uh, I remember there was a bidding yeah. process, and you won that. We'll talk about